to Washington and a major announcement today affecting the future of the auto industry. The Biden administration is proposing strict new pollution rules that could dramatically ramp up the transition to electric vehicles. The big question, are the car companies and the car buyers really ready for this? ABC's M. Wynn is here with more. M. good morning. Good morning, Rhiannon. The Biden administration is looking to ramp up production of electric vehicles. The EPA today is expected to propose strict new limits on car pollution. The goal of the new rules is to ensure that 54 percent of new cars sold in the U.S. by 2030 are electric. The auto industry has already pledged to make electric vehicles 50 percent of new car sales by that same year. But they have a long way to go. Less than 6 percent of vehicles sold last year in the U.S. were electric, and experts say in the end, this is just a proposal by the Biden administration, not necessarily a requirement. They are assumptions built into models rather than hard requirements. But CAFE is designed to be a bit of an elastic band, and it's designed purposefully to stretch to the consumer demands. If consumers prefer larger cars, then the you know, CAFE targets and the fuel efficiency targets come down accordingly. Convincing consumers won't be easy. A new poll shows only four in 10 Americans are even considering an electric car as their next vehicle. Many are turned off by the sticker price. But Walmart is preparing for the future. The company just announced it's adding electric charging stations to thousands of its locations nationwide. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.